Hi, today I will show you how to use the Electra Micro Casa Aleva coffee maker or espresso maker. The first thing, after you switched it on, the pressure needs to be in the green area. I don't know if you can see it here, around 1.5 bar. And the water should be at least half full. Never, ever, never, never, ever switch the machine on without water. This will damage the machine. So, now I will show you how to make a nice little espresso shot. Here I have my coffee and here I have the mill. This is also an electro mill, but of course you can use every brand that is available. Um, the Electra likes very, very fine coffee. I have it on set, set to two of 15 notches. So I will pour a little bit of coffee inside. Sorry, I have no cameraman. This is Ionia coffee from Sicily. I like it very much, but it depends on air pressure and quality of your water, which coffee suits best for your machine. Okay. It is very important that you grind every coffee fresh. So, the first thing I do is I will heat up my cup this will also clean the machine. Just this is the lever. I will press it down and let the water flow. A bit. So put this away and then empty it. Here is still a little water in, and I will clean it. Yeah, and now we will fill in the coffee. I take two flat spoons for one cup. Don't apply too much pressure with the first spoon. So, let's see. We have about this full. I never do two cups uh, at the same time. It is Theoretically possible, but it doesn't taste very well. So I knock it a little bit here. Now I use my stomper. This one is custom made just for the diameter of this thing. And first I pressure quite lightly. I knock a little bit and then I use about 15 kilograms of pressure. I tested it on a scale and uh, turn the stomp a little bit. So now we have nice coffee in there. Put it inside, cup underneath, underneath. And now I use the lever. And after the hissing stops, I let it go and the coffee flows out. So, now we have a nice cup of coffee with a little bit crema. Electro generally doesn't provide too much crema, but the taste is great, especially because of the constant water flow. One last thing, never ever open this right now. It will explode and you have the full kitchen uh, covered in coffee. 
uh, you have to wait at least one minute between shots uh, because of the pressure. You see, this machine is great. It is great for a single household, but for families or parties where you have to pull one shot after the other, it is terrible, but I love it.